Module 2, Navigating the University Library's Website. The goal of this module is for the viewer to navigate the homepage of the University Library's website, libraries.psu.edu. This is the address for the University Library's website. The Penn State University Library's webpage is home to a wealth of information. Being able to locate information to answer our patrons' questions is key to providing excellent customer service. Each page of the University Library's website contains the same heading. Clicking on the words Penn State will take you to the University's webpage at www.psu.edu. Clicking on the words University or Libraries will take you to the homepage for the University Libraries. There are also four links on the Library's homepage navigation system. The links About, Research, Community, and Ask can be accessed from the navigation area at the top of the web page or by clicking on the links below. You can also access information on any library, branch, or campus by clicking on the link that says Penn State University Libraries Change Library. This link is located below the Penn State and University Libraries logo. Not only are the different branches and campus libraries listed here, but the subject libraries for the Petit and Paternal Library are also listed here. On the right of the page are also links to access your library accounts, which include your current PSU checkouts and holds, and your ILLiad account, which contains your borrows from other libraries or your interlibrary loan materials. There is also a link to renew your books. Many times, patrons will want to know how long the library is open or what the hours for a branch library are. An easy way to get this information is through the library's homepage. By clicking on the link that resembles a clock, you can access information for the library page you are on. In my case, it is Petit and Paterno. I can see a calendar view which provides me with the current month's hours, and I can also advance it to future months. The second tab displays the semester hours and exceptions to those hours. The third tab is the campus map, which shows the location of the library. Not every library has a campus map. If you want to find hours for a different library, click on the drop-down arrow to the right of the link for the library hours. The middle section of the website is broken up into two parts. The first section is Research Tools. You can search using Lion Search or the Cat, search for a database or e-journals, or find materials on Course Reserve. You can also search the University Library's website. Next to the Research Tools section is the News and Events section. Here a slideshow carousel can be found. By clicking on an image, you will be able to access more information on the topics presented. The bottom section of the website is broken up into Location, About, Research, Community, and Ask a Librarian. These links will take you to information that may be helpful to our patrons in their use of the library website. The footer at the bottom of the University Library's website contains links to the library's homepage, Penn State University's homepage, the Web Accessibility Feedback Form, our website feedback form, the site index, the library's intranet, which is available to staff only, Penn State University hotlines, and the main phone number to contact the library. There is also a link to copyright information, the date and time the page was last updated, legal statements, and four icons. The Earth icon links to the University Library's green team, the accessibility icon to the web accessibility feedback form, the Facebook and Twitter icons link to pages and Twitter accounts that can be followed for information on the University Libraries. Becoming familiar with the library's website will help you to continue to deliver excellent library services at the University Libraries.